Hello you guys and welcome back to my cooking channel. Uh, today I'm making my uh, beef and bean uh, smothered burrito. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, again, like I said, these is most of the ingredients that I put in it. And I always, you know, when you cooking stuff like that, you always will get for the ground beef, you all want to get 93% lean and 7% fat. Always. Yep, so these is the ingredient that I'm making. Uh, my burrito and my uh, green chili. Okay. And one other ingredient, you guys, that I use. Um... I use this kind of refried bean. Sometimes, if they don't have it, sometimes I just use other. But this is the best refried bean that tastes homemade by that kind. You will not never regret it. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start uh, cut up my onions and brown my ground beef, and you know, put all a little season. And most likely, this is probably the only season that I'm going to put in it. I might add a little garlic powder, onion powder. What else did I use? Oh, and this that I've been kind of using. That. This is so good, you guys. And I got this at uh, Sound Club. Yep, so let me go ahead and get started, you guys. Burning my ground beef, okay? Oh, and this right here, uh, I'm more like guacamole. I like sour cream, but sometimes I like this better. And uh, and another thing is, if you ever make it this kind of Mexican food and stuff, is go ahead and pick up this because it saves a lot, a lot of time. I'm sorry, I had it there. It saves a lot, a lot of time. Um, you cut up your tomatoes and stuff, the top of that go on it. I love this. Okay, and I forgot. I thought I had some frozen chopped onion in my refrigerator. I should have checked before I went to the grocery store. Cause usually, it don't matter. Use always uh, save time to buy the chopped onion that's is already chopped up. So, whatever. It doesn't matter. It's not gonna take me long anyway. All right, so let me get started and go ahead and uh, um, start browning my ground beef. Okay, now you guys are browning my ground beef. I used to like to, again, when I burn ground beef, I like to use this right here to get it all fine. You know, I don't like big chunks of ground beef when I'm making. I don't care what I'm making with ground beef. I just don't like, I like the little, I like for my ground beef to be real fine. Okay, so you see when I'm going with this. Okay, now you guys, I add some of the onions, so I'll add the rest of the one that I cut up. I'm going to go ahead and I'll be right back. I'm just going to go saute this, and I'm going to add my seasoning, okay? And the ground meat should be ready. Okay, now I'm adding my seasoning. Sprinkle a bit. Not too much salt. 
Get a cup of water. Adding. <clears throat> then I stir it up. So that's all my seasoning, you guys. Just let it mm, cook me by seven minutes for to get all the season. And then after they get all the season, I'll uh, work then. Then I'm going to put it in the container, okay? I know I hate frying grease because you get grease everywhere. But that's for the cooking, you guys. Can't do nothing about that. Yep, pour the cookie. All right, so next time I will prepare my beef and beans, smothered burrito with all the topping. Okay. Okay, right back. Okay, now I'm going to make my burrito, you guys. So everything is ready. Again, like I said, I kind of chopped up me some more white onion. Because, you know, when you, I love white onion. Also, my refried bean, my ground beef is ready. Uh, I like to keep this in this container. That's my green chili. That's that. And all my little topping, you guys. Okay. So now I'm just to. So you got how I put everything inside my flour tortilla. And She do. You went to the 
put some inside it. Let's put the melted cheese. You know what I do? I just roll it. You guys don't know how to roll it. You saw how I do it. Show them my. She will swear that Tommy Eby is the real head of this organization and And only if you give up Eby's whole Okay, I'm going to go ahead and say like this video, give this video a thumbs up, share, share, share with your friends and family. <clears throat> the show that was cooking on my cooking channel. And if this is your first time watching my cooking channel, share, share, share with your friends and family as well. Um, the show now was cooking on my cooking channel. Uh, make sure um, to subscribe if you don't mind. I really appreciate it. And if you already subscribed to my cooking channel, thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. And if you want to see the next upload video that I post on my cooking channel, uh, just make sure you guys keep your notification bell on. And you will see the next upload video that I post on my cooking channel. <clears throat> and by that being said, you guys have a blessed day. A blessed day and be safe out there, you guys. Until then, I'll see you guys in the next upload video. See how they look, you guys. Mmm. Now that's what you call the beefy bean smothered deluxe burrito with, with the green chili. Okay. So last thing what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and put the lettuce and tomatoes. What I'm gonna put some of this on first. I love onion. Yes, yes, yes. They say onion is good for your heart. I know my. I used to have an auntie. She used to eat. Um, when she used to cook her good fresh collard green. A pinto bean, she used to eat a whole onion, one of the, like the fresh whole onion. Um, she used to um, just bite into it. I'm talking about the whole onion. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Can I put some cheese on there, you guys? I'm not for sure I did or not. But that's the lettuce. I'm going to go ahead and put some on here. I think I did. Not for sure. Pico sauce. Well, tomatoes. You see how I don't have too much onion in it? That's why I cut up me some more onion. And the last thing, you guys. Put some this on top. I got some sour cream, but I don't want no sour cream on it. This is fresh. You can tell this fresh because look at that hole. Walk up. Just put it on top. And that's my beefy bean smelling deluxe. With, my, with the green chili. Now, I will show you guys when, when I 
store email.